I work full time at a local biotech company. Um, I have four. I'm married with four children and one on the way. And my typical day is usually getting the kids to school, going to work, and doing after school activities with them. So when we started having sex, we just used the condom. And sometime not too long after that, a year or two along the way, we heard about the foam. And I thought it was a really good way of backing up the condom because we've heard stories about condoms breaking. And at that point, we didn't want to have children so young. We were just teenagers. So as a backup, we started to use the foam and the condom together. We knew that we wanted to have our kids back to back so they'd be close and be able to play with each other and keep each other company. Um, we had three daughters in a row and then I wanted to take a break. So we started using condoms and spermicidal foam for a few years until we decided to have my son and then we just stopped using it. And I got pregnant right away. No problem with fertility. My husband's in charge of buying both the condoms and the foam. If we know we're going to have sex, then we put the foam and the condom right near the bed. But if it's like a spur of the moment type thing, it's still in the closet. And sometimes we, if during the heat of the moment, we have to stop and he has to go get it. I don't personally like to put things inside of my body. So for that reason, I've never personally used a tampon or put the applicator inside my body. And so since I'm uncomfortable, my husband does it for me, puts the foam in. I chose condoms and foam as my method because there is no hormones involved and it doesn't interrupt um, or alter the natural female cycle. My name is Marisela, I'm 29 and my form of protection is condoms and spermicidal foam.